Hi, this is Nicole from Lilies and Leon, and welcome to Mini Master presented by Nestle Pure Life. So Halloween is one of our absolute favorite holidays, and today we're gonna show you guys how to do three DIY family costumes on a budget. So the first costume I'm gonna show you guys is Rockstar and Biggest Fan. So a lot of the materials for this we already had at home. So you can use a pair of black sneakers. We already had black pants and a black shirt in Lucas's closet. We got a wallet chain and red tie. And the last piece of the costume was a microphone which we created um, using materials from a craft store. So I'm gonna show you how to put this together with Lucas. So to make the microphone, you're gonna need a cardboard tube, styrofoam bowl that we've colored in black with a Sharpie, but you can also use acrylic paint and duct tape, as well as a hot glue gun, which only you should use, not the kids. So when they're all done, you can put the ball of the mic on with the hot glue gun. So I've pre-cut some tape that Lucas can use. So here, baby. You're gonna put this on now. So it's super easy and it becomes a really fun mic that you can use for the costume. So the inspiration behind this costume was Billy Joe Armstrong from Green Day because we love music in our house and we love going to concerts and live events. So we wanted to incorporate something really fun and really rock star-esque um, for this Halloween costume. That's perfect. So basically then you would take your styrofoam ball and with a hot glue gun, um, put the glue over here and make sure you do this when the kids are all done crafting so that they don't get um, any glue on them. And then that's it. So this is the look all complete. So Lucas, show them your mic. <laughs> I also made a shirt for myself um, using a bleach pen that says biggest fan and I also made one for his little sister for his, his biggest little fan but she fell asleep. But super cute and easy way to um, create a shirt. Just use a bleach pen on a black fabric, super easy. And that's it. Yeah. <laughs> So for our next costume, we chose something that would work for the entire family and we chose The Lion King because we absolutely love the Broadway show and we thought it would be really fun to incorporate this um, with both kids and mom and dad. So for this, you'll need uh, neutral colored clothing so you can use anything that you already have in your closet or go to the thrift store and find some cheap pieces that um, will work in golds or tans, anything neutral and you'll need fabric, two different shades, um, one darker than the other, and you can use fabric, again, or you can use felt. And for the ears, you'll need a plastic headband and some supplies from the craft store. So again, we're using a hot glue gun, kid-friendly scissors, some paper, as well as face paint um, for the kids. So I'm gonna have Lucas join me again so he can help make the ears, and we're gonna paint up his face. So the ears are pretty simple to make and I'm gonna show you how to do them. So you can get the kids involved by having them trace out your template and in order to make the template, it's basically just a half circle in any size that you want it to be and this will be done on cardstock. So once you have your template, you're gonna take your first cutout and put it on a piece of fabric leaving some space. You're gonna cut it out and the end result is going to look like this, and this is going to be the outer part of your ear. For the inner part of your ear, you're going to take the other fabric in the darker shade and cut the same template a little bit smaller, and at the end it's going to look like this, um, which is pretty neat and you can just fold it in and it'll be the ear, the completed ear. For the headband part, you're going to take a plastic headband, a piece of fabric, fold it over, use your hot glue gun, and the end result is going to look like this. Put the two together and voila, you have your, your lion ears. Super cute and super easy to make. So this is the finished product. And for dad or Mufasa, we just got a grass a uh, hula skirt, cut it up, and attached it to the headband, and that's it. The last costume I'm going to share with you guys are Day of the Dead inspired costumes, which are super easy and fun to put together. So we're gonna use the same 
black shirt and black pants that we used for the other costume. And again, this was just items that we found in Lucas's closet. And for your boys, um, a black hat and these supplies that you can find at any craft store, which are just some flowers and lace. So for Lily or for your baby, um, you'll need some sort of stretchy headband and then the same materials as the hat, which just a little bit of lace and the flowers, which you can hot glue on. So the best part of this costume is the Sugar Skull face painting. And for this, we drew inspiration from the Nestle Pure Life Share Scare water bottles. And so I'm gonna bring Lucas out now and paint his face and we're gonna show you the final look. Thank you so much for following along. I hope you got some great ideas and had as much fun watching as we did making the costumes. And for more family fun, check out Mini Master on Ticketmaster. <laughs>